hello guys welcome back to my channel In today's video i'm going to be showing you one of the easiest quick breakfast that you can prepare and enjoy as well if you want to know how i make this yummy delicious nigeria pancake stay tuned and keep on watching <music> So here are the few ingredients that we are going to be using. I have one cup of all-purpose flour. I have three egg, vanilla extracts, and I have spinach here. I have already sliced it very tiny. And I have my salt as well. And I have one teaspoon of sugar and chili pepper, okay? So if you don't want to add this chili pepper, it's optional, you can just skip it. And I have my bowl here that I'm going to be using to mix. And I have one cup of milk as well. I didn't introduce my milk to you earlier, so I will show you when I want to put it in my pancake. So first of all, I'll be breaking my eggs inside my bowl. So I'll be breaking two eggs inside, and I will reserve one for later use, okay? So after breaking my egg inside my pan, I'm going to be adding my sugar. So next I'm going to be adding my pepper and my salt okay so if you don't want to add your pepper you can first skip it as I said earlier so next I'm adding my spinach to it as well so I'm adding just a drop of vanilla extract and I'll mix everything together until it is well combined so after mixing it I'm going to be adding my milk to it as well. I have two cups of milk, okay? I have two cups of milk that I just pour inside my bowl. So I'll mix everything proper. After mixing it very well, I'm going to be adding my all-purpose flour to it. So I have one cup of flour here, all right? So after adding it, I will mix it very well. So at this stage, you need to mix it proper until there will be no lumps on it at all, okay? As you can see right now. So next, I'm going to be adding a teaspoon of vegetable oil. I have some flour here. So I just added a teaspoon of my sunflower oil. After that, I will mix it proper. So guys, so as you can see, I'm through mixing. So I'm going to be transferring it inside this cup. I will make me that will help me to pour it inside my pan very easy. So at this stage, I've already put my pan on my cooker, so I will preheat my pan before adding my pancake to it. Okay, so this is my final result. Stage I've already preheat my pan. Okay, so next I'm going to be adding a little drop of my sunflower oil. So you can also use your butter if you have butter, okay. So I'll just spread the oil around my pan. As, as you can see what I'm doing right now. I'll just spread the oil so that you rub all the pan. So after doing that, I'm going to be pouring in my pancake to it. So when you want to pour it, you pour it bit by bit. You don't need to pour everything once, okay? <laughs> so after pouring the size or the quantity that I need inside my pan. As you can see what I'm doing right now, I'll just spread it around my pan. I'll just spread it round, 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 round like this. So after spreading it, I will just leave it on my cooker and I will leave my cooker on a very low heat, okay? So after baking it for about two to three minutes, I will flip it to the other side okay I'll flip it to the other side so that I will cook the other side for at least two minutes maximum okay so So guys, as you can see, my pancake is ready, alright? So I'm going to be showing you another method that you can make and enjoy your pancake as well. So, 
before we start i'm going to be dropping a little bit of my oil inside my pan as well so i'll spread it around okay then after then i'll add my pancake to it So guys after like about one minute i'm going to be breaking the remaining egg that i show you earlier wrong that so we are going to be using later so i'll put it inside my pancake and i'll add a little bit of chili pepper to it so after adding my chili pepper and i'll add a pinch of salt just a pinch of salt so i'm going to be spreading missing my egg proper so i'll miss it and use it to rub all my pancake okay as you can see what i'm doing right now i'm just trying to use it to cover all the pancake okay so this is about two minutes all right so i'll flip it to the other side as well do you see that so yummy and it looks so good and very tasty as well okay <laughs> very very tasty so guys this is after two minutes i'm just trying to flip it to the other side again okay did you see it is well cooked well cooked okay I'll just leave it for the other side for at least one minute maximum. So if, after about one minute, I will take it out. I will set it aside. So I'm going to be doing the remaining one off camera. Okay. So this is my final result. I'm through making my pancake. So this is the first one that I show you. You see, it's so good. When you make your pancake this way, if you are the type that don't like eating pancake. Just try this method okay I love my pancake this way and my kids love it this way as well okay so when you prepare it like this for your kids definitely they are going to enjoy it very very well you see it's so good and the taste is perfect the taste is fat is delicious so this is the other one that I show you that I add egg on so you see it's so good as well so when you make your pancake this way for your kids they are going to love it if the first time when i start making pancake when i make it my kids will not like it so when i try using different methods in fact they enjoy pancake and whenever i make pancake in fact they enjoy it perfectly well so if your kids don't like eating pancake just try this method they are, go, they are definitely going to enjoy it and they will be asking for more and more okay <laughs> they will be asking for more so i have different methods of making pancake but this is one of the methods that i'm showing you on this video so later on i'll be showing you other method that you can use as well to enjoy your pancake this is the one method that i show you on this video i hope you enjoy it and you will give it a try if you enjoy it if you enjoy watching this video please don't forget to give me a thumbs up like share this video to your friends your family okay share this video to your community on your facebook share it wherever you feel that you can share it. this video that is good share this video i really appreciate you all thank you all so much for watching thank you for staying to this extent please before you go don't forget to give me a thumbs up and i'll catch you in my next video